also only learn from the stories but i thought you people will talk to me and carry the story it didn't happen and i continue to see even today i see a story but if you go through i was going through you will see that okay it's a product of speculation assumption presumption and i can stop you from presuming and assuming and having a juicy story i think it will have more audience but the fact is that uh, please hear from the horse's mouth before a story of such nature is told. Because this type of stories send conflicting messages, and uh, I have reasons to believe that these stories must be also connected with the election that's on. Because today is a polling. So, young election, the polling has been just completed, and on the run up for this election. So I think I have made it abundantly clear last time when uh, one of our media friends uh, managed to connect with me on the phone. Is it an attempt to actually divert the narrative? The narrative which should be focused on very serious important issues confronting the people of the Has somebody attempted and uh, successfully utilized some from amongst our you know, friends from media? You have to that's why I would say that the moment we have these stories coming as a part of some of these speculation, we are always available. Please get connected and get from the most. It is natural for every political party uh, to stabilize for themselves and we are doing the same. We also would like other MLS to join us march with our party. We welcome many of our friends who would decide if I join in with TMC maybe we can aggregate our state together and work together. I think the state needs to be unification and coming together of all political parties. I have tried this along with my colleagues, along with my party functionaries, including some of the leaders of different political parties. Immediately after the election results were declared, on the third you have seen you know, the whole collective endeavor to do justice to the aspirations of the people, to do justice to the mandate of the people. What is the mandate of the people? The mandate of the people is abundantly clear that the mandate of the people was to have an alternative government. Alternative government and replace the earlier government. See, Ba El Hak is a very good friend of me. We have worked together for a long, long time. He was in Congress while we were in Congress. He was in the Council of Ministers when I was the CM. So you have seen this long association. And the uh, good thing is that he wanted to meet me on the 3rd. On the 3rd. That means second was the result, no? On the 3rd of uh, March morning, we had tea. And uh, we congratulated each other. But he was in a hurry to go to his meeting. But he told me one thing. He told me one thing. He said that he was not happy with the outcome of the whole uh, election results. Obviously, because uh, I think BJP also went hammer and tong uh, to see that they win as many seats as available. But his uh, concern was pertaining to whether we allow the continuation of this government. So only one thing he said, uh, please do anything to see that this same reason does not come again. And we said, we are doing it precisely. And then that you saw as a, as a, as a sequel to that. On the third, we tried to come together. It's a different thing that we could not uh, give fruition to our uh, whole collective effort. Because as I have said, uh, the uh, overall development that you saw after all these uh, members of different political parties converged to one particular place, committing to that agenda of giving an alternative, viable, pro-people, the most wanted alternative 
government to the people. So that's the time when I met. But he didn't say that I should join BJP nor anything. He only said that please do something to see that this government doesn't come back. Yes, we all agree. Even now I say that this government should go. In fact, even now, all these political parties. But the thing is that you are seeing, you are seeing the desperate attempt of the people who are in the present dispensation, in authority, desperately trying to remain in power. Why do I say this? You have seen recently murder of two members belonging to one regional parties. What does it indicate? You have to be analytical and find out the background. What are those uh, factors which have compelled these two MLS to ultimately decide to march with this MPP? So I think you have all the answers. <coughs> Must have followed with the fallout that you see and reinstallation of the same regime. And it will be our incumbent responsibility to see that we find ways and means now to effectively respond to our call of duty in protecting the interests of the people and the state. We have taken resolve with utmost sense of sincerity that under any circumstances we will not allow anybody to take the interests of the people and the state for granted. Our resolve is there to ensure that we protect the interests of the people and interests of the state. And in the coming days, you will see many things happening, many things unfolding, and we will be taking on this government. You will see many things happen. Please wait and have some amount of patience. We will not be found wanting in discharging our responsibilities.